Hello students, let's continue our journey through Comparing quantities Let's enter into a new topic that is Loss and loss percentage A farmer bought seeds and fertilizer for rupees 500. Due to heavy rain, his yield was not good. After harvest, he got only 10 kilograms crop. He sold each kilogram for rupees 30. What was his loss? Also calculate his loss percent. We have the cost price of seeds and fertilizers. CP equals rupees 500. The selling price of 1 kilogram of the crop, SP equals rupees 30. So the selling price of 10 kilograms of the crop equals rupees 30 multiplied by 10 kilograms equals rupees 300. We have to calculate the loss. That is, loss equals 500 rupees minus 300 rupees equals 200 rupees. Then we can say that loss equals cost price minus selling price or loss equals CP minus SP. Now, we have to find his loss percent. For calculating the loss percent, we have to divide the loss by cost price multiplied by 100. We know that Loss equals rupees 200. Therefore, loss percent equals 200 divided by 500 multiplied by 100 equals 40%. Therefore, the farmer faced a 40% loss. Let us do another example. On selling a table for rupees 940, Jack had a loss of 6%, using the loss percent. Find out the cost price of the table. We have, selling price equals, rupees 940. Loss percent equals 6%. We have to find cost price. We know that, selling price equals, cost price minus, loss. Here loss equals 6% of CP equals 6 divided by 100 multiplied by CP. Therefore, SP equals CP minus loss equals CP minus 6 multiplied by CP divided by 100. That is, rupees 940 equals CP minus 6 multiplied by CP, divided by 100. 940 equals 100 CP minus 6 CP divided by 100. 940 equals 94 CP divided by 100. Therefore, CP equals 940 multiplied by 100 divided by 94 equals 1000. Therefore, the cost price of the table equals rupees 1000. Let's have a quick recap. Today we discussed the topics of loss and loss percentage. Before winding up, let's see how much you understood today's topic by doing an activity. A man bought a wristwatch for rupees 2200 and sold it for rupees 1980. Find loss and loss percentage. That's all for now. See you all in the next class with another interesting topic.